Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? It's your boy, The Ghettoographer, a.k.a. Pastor Tech, coming back at you with another unboxing video. And today, we're going to be unboxing a brand new watch. A brand new watch. A brand new watch. As you all know, if you see my other watch videos, I've been trying to, you know, change it up this year, trying to get me some watches that I can wear out, um, get used to wearing them and everything like that. So without further ado, let's get to the Eagle Eye View. But before we get to the Eagle Eye View, please do me a favor, please like, share, and subscribe. Give us a thumbs up, like, that's the like, share, and subscribe so we can grow this unboxing nation. All right, let's get to the Eagle Eye View. All right, guys, we're in the Eagle Eye View. This is not going to be a long unboxing. But there's no normal how I fix this box, box, box look. All right, let's go ahead and open it up. This is the one I got, guys. Nothing else in here. Like I said, this is not going to be a long unboxing. And here we go. I don't even know what this one is called. So we'll find all that out together. All right, so here we go. So what do y'all think about this one? This one right here cost me less than $60. I think I paid about. No, it cost me less than this. I think I paid about almost sixty for it. That will it was on sale, and then you know you got their tag and what how much they want you to think it was worth. It ain't worth that. So uh, this is how I look. The front looks. So let's see what this is. This is the Aviator, the Victus Trinity. It's Japanese movement, 50 meters water resistance. Model number is 45750. You can see everything else. Uh, stainless steel case. And there you go. Fusion crystal. So there you go, guys. So this is it. So let me go get, show you, compared to the other watches I recently got. Guys, Hold on. This is the Pendos right here. Just got this as an everyday kind of type of watch where, you know, every day bought this one. This is the, the latest one I did, this one. And I got the Pro Diver here. And so when you look at all three, you know, trying to get different watches, guys, just trying to, you know, round them out different colors, different type of styles, you know. But I, I do like this. I do like I think it's different. Um, I know people, some people don't like the Invictus brand, but I think it's pretty decent. And like I said, you can find these um 60 50 40 dollars um if you you know don't want to get a real expensive watch some people like Invictus. there's watches and victors that cost a lot more but i do like it got three got one two got those three there i think this rotates as well so that's pretty good so let's get back to the regular view Give you my final thoughts. Yo, yo, yo i'm back guys to give you my final thoughts on the invicta um model number um 45 seven five zero four five seven five zero i like it um i got it because it's kind of different so you know you wear something blue or some gold it can match that or you know any other color that match it but i like it it's pretty decent guys like i showed you before um what i would tell you is never pay full price um like i said i've been getting um i think i got this one from tj Maxx for like under 60 dollars guys so what i would tell you is if you're looking for a watch and you like Invictus, you can go to TJ Maxx and they'll have some and sometimes they'll have them on sale um, tremendously. Never go to the mall to and buy one because every time I go to the mall, they're always trying to give me to buy one for two to $300 when I know they're not worth two to $300. Um, so what I would tell you is if you go to TJ Maxx or go somewhere where they sell them at and you can get you know a pretty decent watch. If you're looking for an Invictus watch, you know, some people don't like them. I understand. I think the next watch I'm going to get is going to be as I guess one guy said, God tier, um, Casio G Shock. So I'm saving up to get me a G Shock watch. Be my first time ever having one. Um, so I like this watch, guys. What do you think of this watch? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you like it, Invictus? You don't like Invictus. Um, for me, I do like them. I mean, the one that I got, which is right here, the one that somebody gave me, still works, guys. This one right here still works. It still works. So, and I've had it for a while now. So, I do like the Invictus. Um, 
like I said, I don't know where you can get this model from. If you like this, I'll try to find it, put it in the description below. But guys, do me a favor. Please do me a favor. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you, everybody. We're above 800 um, subscribers, so thank you. Trying to get to over 1,000 by the end of the year, way over 1,000 by the end of the year. But I can only do that for if you like, share, and subscribe. I also want to thank my new and current subscribers for still rocking with your boy. This is your boy, V. Ghetto Ogrifer, thank you for rocking out with me on another unboxing video. Guys, we got some more unboxings coming. So do me a favor, please hit that notification bell so you can be notified anytime we drop a brand new video. See you soon, guys. Peace.